Well, today we're going to give you an unboxing session, and uh, this time we're uh, going to talk about the S Digital Base Cruiser. Special thanks to our friends from Band Bros for giving us this unit for our review. As you can see, guys, we're going to unbox the S Digital Base Cruiser. And it's here right here with us. And special thanks to our friends from Band Bros for providing us a review unit. Thank you guys for sending this to us. Now, let us proceed and uh, talk about the base cruiser. As you can see, these are all the features you can get with it. And we're going to touch on each and every bit of its features. It has Bluetooth, connecti connectivity, USB, MP3. Yes, that's right. You can play your music through the USB and MP3 as well. It is rechargeable. It has wireless mic inside, aux input, and also FM. So pretty cool things inside the box. Of course, it has battery for the microphone. You have right here the battery and also a uh, quick start guide. That's the first thing you see there. And at the same time, there's a free microphone. Of course, there's a battery, so you just simply have to jack in the batteries and use the microphone yourself. And apart from that, we also have, of course, the adapter so should you want to charge the s digital base cruiser all you have to do is use this charging adapter and last but not the least we have of course this big but very portable yes it's big but portable base cruiser as you can see right there oh god it's moving okay there you go now, these are the things that you can see on uh, the base cruiser. Of course, these are the controls as you can see. There's a uh, volume knob right here. There's an LED as well so you see what you're looking at. And also some presets for equalizer. And also the, the tuner for uh, the track. So should you want to choose a certain track on your MP3 or Bluetooth if it's connected to your phone, you just simply use this to, co to control. And also Bluetooth repair, Bluetooth pair. So if you wish to pair this on your, for example, on your iPhone or iPad or even Android devices, all you have to do is to tap that Bluetooth and pair button. There's also a source button. So should you want to switch from USB to aux in or to Bluetooth, all you have to do is to tap that source. And also echo if you want to increase echo or not, depending on where you are. So if you're going to sing and you want to use a bit of echo while singing, then these are the controls that you need to press. Of course, mic volume and of course the switch for the light rather. So there is a switch for the light and before I forget, the play button. Now, unlike other trolley speakers, this one has an adjustable handle. So if you really want to bring this with you whenever, wherever you travel, all you have to do is you know lift this up and of course there are rollers at the bottom and these rollers are very durable as I was told because uh, they uh, tested this several times bang it on the floor and even uh, rolled it several times for them to be able to see the quality of the roller now there is also an antenna at the back so if you want to use FM all you do is to lift that antenna at the back it's very portable it's a little heavy if I may say and uh, I guess but still despite the fact that it's a little heavy uh, it is still portable by my standards now I can lift it with one hand as you can see but there's a bit of tension there but manageable at the right side there, you go, there are several buttons that you may want to check take a look at of course there's an on and off button there's a line in and DC jack Again, if you wish to charge it, all you have to do is to jack in the adapter to the DC jack. And also a line in. Okay. There are two USB, one for the MP3 and the other one is uh, for the charger. And for the charger, it charges up to 5 volts, 1 ampere. So it doesn't, it will not charge your uh, devices a little, quite fast, but still, it can charge your smartphones. Now, at the bottom, there are two provisions for microphones. Yes, there's a wireless microphone, but you can add two more microphones because, again, it has two microphone jacks just at the bottom of uh, the ports that I recently mentioned. 
overall, guys, it's uh, actually uh, a well-packed uh, trolley, and uh, as far as far as I know, this is uh, one of the most one of the well-featured trolley speakers I've seen in the market uh, today. This is a sound test using the S Digital Bass Cruiser. The speaker volume is now set at maximum. The microphone is set at C10. The sound recorder is situated three feet from the source. And we are playing a music using a smartphone connected via Bluetooth to the speaker. Minimize the volume of the speaker from maximum to 20 only. And now we're going to set the volume of the speaker from 20 to 15. We're adjusting the volume of the speaker from 15 to 10. adjusting it to 5. While this is just an unboxing, let me give you my quick verdict about the Bass Cruiser. The Bass Cruiser is an interesting device and may be suitable for several or for some target market. It may not be good for you, but it may be good for some people. And who are these people that I'm referring to? I'm referring to speakers, teachers, those people who throw a party inside their houses or anywhere they want to, and also those people who wish to transfer their audio devices from one place to another inside their house. Now I guess guys, if you were the target market that I mentioned, you may want to consider this. So that's it guys, that has been our quick unboxing and a quick verdict of the S Digital Base Cruiser and I hope you guys enjoyed our unboxing session for today. Again, this has been GN, and thank you for watching this video. If you haven't subscribed to our page, please do so. And if you haven't liked our Facebook page, we would appreciate if you can do that as well. And if you have any comments, you know, just use that comment section below. Thank you for watching, and see you soon on our next video.